let's take a quick look at how we can add a custom label to our iLock version 2. So here are the things you'll need. Of course, you'll need an iLock version 2. You'll need a piece of paper, some scissors, and a pen. You'll, of course, need to cut out your paper or you know whatever you happen to want to stick in there, maybe a sticker of some kind, and cut it down to approximately the size of this little square here. Now, you can put whatever kind of custom label you want on your iLock. Maybe you want some sort of a, a band initials. Maybe you want some sort of a number. Or maybe you just want to go with, say, colors. You know, this is a, like a copper color. I could put a copper color in here, and then I could, if I had multiple iLock version 2s, I could maybe put like a red paper in another one, yellow in another one. And I can also label those within the iLock license manager, so I could quickly see, you know, my yellow iLock, my red iLock, and so on. Maybe you want some sort of artwork or picture. You can customize it however you want. So the label will go right under this area here. Now, we could just kind of, you know, slide... It in there this is actually a slightly too large but we could slide it in there without actually having to take this cover off it slides in there all right a little bit sticky but you'll probably have a little bit better and easier of a time if we go and take this off so you'll need a pin and we'll just put it on the back so you can see how i'm holding the eye lock here on its back and you can see right here there's a little nub that keeps this plastic piece on there now i suggest you use something like a pin something that's not sharp because you don't want to hurt yourself so just push that in, doesn't take much, and you can just slide it right off, just like that. All right, so there we go. Now we can take whatever label we choose, maybe we want some sort of number on there, and then simply slide your plastic piece back on. Of course, if your label is slightly too big, you'll have to go ahead and trim that down slightly more. All right, put it on there, slide it on, and then you'll have your custom label on there and again you can choose whatever sort of label you want like an artwork some sort of a color maybe a band initials or maybe your initials whatever you want just pop it in there now we want to make sure that we actually slide this on this plastic piece on the correct way that nub is going to go towards the end of the eye lock here towards the words that says eye lock if you have it this way it's not going to go on you want it this way here you see that there all right so we'll just pop this on like so and then it clicks right into place you see here on the back that nub is holding our plastic piece our casing on there securely so there's our label so there is our newly freshly labeled iLock version 2 so now we know exactly what iLock we're dealing with when we go to the back of our computer and we're checking for certain licenses and whatnot and again you can also give a custom name to your iLocks in the iLock license manager so you can better tell exactly what they are so maybe if i would name this one like iLock 2 I or if I had the copper in there and name it iLock Copper, so on and so forth. So there you go. It's a real easy way to label your iLock version 2 so you can quickly and easily tell exactly what iLock you're dealing with. You can learn more about iLock at iLock.com.